To date, we have uh, evacuated 623 children from the streets of Kampala and, and the urban and peri-urban uh, areas in Uganda. Though the, the program has not spread to the rest of the, the, the country because we requested for 3.4 billion Uganda shillings. And as at 30th June, they had released 1 billion from the government coffers to the Ministry of Gender uh, for, the for the sectoral committee, the three partner agencies, that is Kampala State Council, Uganda Police, and the Ministry of Gender. So by that time, we still had a deficit of 2.4 billion required to sustainably um, maintain the status quo because as you can see now, the children for the first time in the history of Uganda have, have not been on the streets, but a few remnants of them who are coming, we are trying to show permanent presence on the streets. We are destroying their temp temporary uh, residence, the Bivera, in, uh, in, uh, in the suburbs of Kampala, where they were renting by, you know, 500 a night and sleeping in turns. So we are destroying them. In return, we have created 139 permanent residents for the homeless children. So, and they are evenly spread through the country. But on top of that, we have tried to, 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 to excitefully bring on board new activities which are meant to excite them to remain where they are, such as sports. So to date, we have 118 children uh, undergoing sports, intensive sports training. On Monday, the 12th of August, 2019, Uganda will once again join the rest of the world and the UN fraternity in making the commemoration of the International Youth Day celebration. The theme for this year's celebration is transforming education for responsible citizenship and employment creation. National celebrations will take place in Jinja district at St. Gonza Gagonza Primary School, Kagoma, on 12th of August 2019.